Hey guys, Connor here with Chrome Designs and thank you for watching this video. Today I'm going to be showing you how to create some perspective 3D text. Uh, I know there's a lot of tutorials on how to create 3D text but this is different in its own little way. Uh, so for example as you see the text here is going straight on and it's kind of looking straight towards you and it's got some depth going behind it. Uh, usually the traditional way to do this is to maybe hold down Control alt and um, just press the arrow keys to choose what way you want it to go uh, but that will kind of just create it so it's fading one way so kind of it's on a slant in the 3D-ness uh, as opposed to this straight on 3D text here and in fact this way is probably a lot easier so I just go to file new and uh, it doesn't matter about the project settings for me uh, I just want to go to your text tool uh, just type uh, I'm going to type Connor and I'm just going to hit control A and I'm just going to get go to edit free transform I'm going to really crank it up just so you can see it here. Okay. And also, I'm going to highlight it and change the color to black, like so. So, here we go. We've got the basic text. However, it's, it's 2D and you want to make it 3D. Uh, the first thing we're going to do is we're going to add a gradient overlay. And it will be traditionally black and white. Just change the white to a dark gray. Uh, just create a bit of, just gives it a nice effect as opposed to all black. And that is it. Click OK. Uh, now, if you duplicate that layer, just go to Control J. Uh, the top layer, if you go to Edit Free Track, well, no, in fact, if you just go to the layer style, right click Blending Options, and go to Color Overlay. Uh, it doesn't matter what color it is, it, it, it won't matter at all, it's just so you can see. Uh, it's on red, uh, the default, and go to Edit Free Transform, and just go out to the side. And you'll see that it's starting to create some 3D like text. Uh, but if you just go out to the side and you see that I moved over to the left, now if you use the right arrow key, you can kind of line it up like so. And that looks as though it's actually three actual 3D text. If you want to maybe give it a bit more depth, you know, you can always widen it a little bit more. Uh, you want to make sure you've got it in the middle. So go and center it there, like so. And that's just a way how to create some 3D looking text. Uh, what you could do is you could go into the layer style and take off color overlay, uh, but you won't notice much difference. So in the gradient overlay, I'm going to change it just a bit. I'm going to change it to a lighter kind of gray, and a lighter gray again, like so, maybe a dark gray there. There we go, like that. And that is about it. Now that is how to create some perspective 3D text in Photoshop. Uh, thanks for watching this video. Uh, appreciate it. Comment, like, and subscribe. And I'll see you guys soon.